Robinson Sewer Partners visiting Matt Atala from Atala Wines. Matt, could you tell us a little about uh, Atala Wines and what you're trying to achieve? Yeah, hi John, thanks for that. Um, Atala Wines, I'm focusing on producing single vineyard, single batch wines from the best vineyards in the Orange region, focusing on Chardonnay, Shiraz, and this year I'm making my first Cabernet Franc. Just wondering, uh, do a bit of a rundown on the winemaking process and where we're up to here. Well, what we're doing here, John, is I'm about to plunge one of my Cabernet Franc ferments. Plunging involves keeping the skins submerged uh, in the wine. As you know, with red wine, you ferment the wine and the juice together, and the uh, fermentation helps extract the colour and the tannins from the skin, as you can see from this beautiful colour of my red wine. Beautiful. Thanks, Matt. Matt, can you tell us a little bit uh, about the yeast uh, that you put in the wine and why you do that? Sure, John. Uh, without yeast, wine is effectively just grape juice. So the sugars in grape juice are converted into alcohol by yeast. And you can use natural wild yeast or you can use commercially uh, cultured yeasts. I have chosen to use two different types of yeast in my ferments. So one will accentuate, help accentuate the bright fruit of this particular wine. The other one will help uh, develop the mouthfeel of this wine. So the two of them together will be a nice blending components. Right. And Matt, why do you test the BOMA? So the BOMA is the level of sugar remaining in the ferment and we test it two or three times a day to ensure that the ferment is tracking uh, healthily. So the sugar level is dropping and the alcohol level is rising and the easiest way to do that is just to check the sugar level. So I'm just about to do that now. Right. So you give the hydrometer a spin to knock off any CO2 that's collecting around it because the fermentation produces CO2. And what's the reading, Matt? So this wine is actually in negative BOMO, which means the fermentation is fairly well complete. Uh, we're actually planning on pressing this tomorrow, uh, which sits well with where the sugar is right now, and the taste and the flavour and the mouthfeel are all pretty much where I want it. Fantastic. Thanks, Matt. Robinson Silk Partners with uh, Matt Atala, Atala Wines. Thanks, John.